draw a tree diagram for independent events. You will find this on page 644 in the Namibia Ordinary Level Mathematics Textbook Y equals NX plus C to success. Let's go through an example. When a girl wakes up each morning, the probability that she will feel happy is 0, 0,9. So, what is the probability that she will not be happy? So, happy is 0, 0,9. Remember, this pair must add up to 1. So, if this is 0, 0,9, you can say 1 minus 0, 0,9, and that will give you 0, 0,1. So, Every day, the same is happening. Happy, 0, 0,9. Not happy, 0, 0,1. Happy, 0, 0,9. Not happy, 0, 0,1. What is the probability that she will feel happy when she wakes up on both Monday and Tuesday? So, what will be that road? Let's just mark that road. Happy happy. What do we do in a branch? We are going to multiply. So it's going to be 0, 0,9 multiply 0, 0,9 and that will give us 0.81. Okay, next one. Let's just mark. What is the probability that she will feel happy when she wakes up? on either Monday or Tuesday next week, but not on both days. So no, this is not, but it's the same repeating for next week. So let's just clean this. Okay, so it's going to be more or less the same. Okay, but it's two branches. So one day happy, the other day not happy. One day happy, the other day not happy. So every time it will be 0, 0,9 multiply 0, 0,1 or 0, 0,1 multiply 0, 0,9. So in the branches I multiply. But what do I do over the branches? I add it up. So that will be 0.18. Okay. Uh, stop the video and do try now 13, this number 1, this one, okay. You can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's start. I just want to get the pen and the marker. In a game of chance on a machine, a player can win with a probability of one third, lose with a probability of two over five, or draw. Another game is allowed after a draw, very important, but not otherwise. It's not necessary that they give you this tree diagram. If they don't give it to you, you must construct it yourself. Okay, let's just see what's happening there. Okay, this is my branches. Remember, this must add up to one. If it's a draw, we will now fill in. You will try again. So every time it's a draw, you will try again. So let's just fill it in. This is win. Just get the pin. This is win, this is draw, this is lose. Win, draw, lose. Win, draw, lose. Okay, now let's just see. The probability they give it to you for a win is one third. The probability for a lose is two over five. So I must basically find this one. But can you remember that I said that if, if, if you have a split there, it, if it's two, it must add up to one. If it's three, it must add up to one. If it's four, it must still add up to one. So basically, I can, to find this position there, I can just say one minus the win minus the lose. You can press it on the calculator, but it's not necessary. You can just go and say, okay, make it. So it's times 15 is the LCM. You can do it without. Multiply 5, multiply 5, multiply 3, multiply 3. And that will give us 15 over 15 
minus 5 over 15 minus 3 over 15 and that will give us a final answer uh, no it's not 3 over 15 sorry I just didn't multiply um, it's going to be 6 over 15 and that will give us a final answer of 4 over 15 so what does this mean this draw will be 4 over 15 okay now Copy and complete the tree diagram. That's what we did there. We copy it and we complete. Okay, but can I just show you this? If this, every time this will be a third, every time this will be 4 over 15, every time this will be 2 over 5. So this is a third, this is 4 over 15, and this will be 2 over 5. And it actually can continue like this. Okay. Now, let's start with number B. Let's go to number B. Find the probability that Adurai will win after one game. Okay. This is Margaret, it's I. So the probability win after one game. And, and remember, can I just show you here? This is the first game. This is the second game. And this is the third game. And if I continue, it would have been the fourth, the fifth. Okay, so after the first game, so the probability will just be the winning 1 over 3. It's actually the one they are giving you. Okay, the second one. Exactly two games. Now we can highlight it. So remember, you must draw, okay, I want to just take another color, sorry. Okay, you must draw and then um, he's going to win. So it's going to be that branch. So can you remember how do we do that? We're going to say probability win after two games. And that is going to be 4 over 15 multiply 1 over 3. And if I go and multiply that, I'm going to, you can just press it on your calculator, I'm going to get, okay, let's just write it in, 4 over 45. That is going to be my answer. Okay, so in this, this next one, the third one, exactly, so the probability win after three games okay now can we mark that again so basically it's just going to be let's just see he's going to draw he's going to draw again and then he's going to win okay so the probability of that will be um, and I'm just going to write it. So it's just that extra 4 over 15 multiply 4 over 15 and then the winning 1 over 3. And that will give me a uh, final answer of 16 over 6, 7, 5. Okay, and then number C, the final one. What is the probability that Yesaya can continue after three games? Now, now, when will he continue? Let's just mark that road. He can only continue if he draw, 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 and then he will continue. So basically, we can just write it, the probability, and that's that continue. after three games 
and that's going to be 4 over 15 multiply 4 over 15 multiply 4 over 15 and the final answer is going to be 64 over 3375 that's going to be the final answer